hey y'all welcome back to my channel you are watching something about drea and Kay, and today i'm going to be showing you guys how i got this cute easy ponytail style on her y'all ready let's go so we getting right into it the first thing that i'm going to do is blow dry her hair out and i'm going to get it as straight as i can using the paddle brush so that her hair is stretched out Now that her hair is all stretched out, I'm just going to part out the center of her head and I'm going to begin to lay her hair down section by section so that I can get this ponytail as smooth as I can get it. So the products that I'm going to use to smooth her hair down is got to be glue spray, eco styler gel, and I'll go over top of it with got to be glue gel and also Hicks edge control. The Hicks edge control just give it a good shine. So I've already done the middle section and I'm going to show you guys just how I did it. I know you guys probably saying like that's a lot of product on her hair. Um, but the way I did it, it's really mostly only Eco Styler. That's what you see me putting on her hair here. Eco Styler is the only product that is in the middle of her head. And I'm just going to take her hair section by section and brush the Eco Styler through. And this just helps me to get her hair more smooth because her hair is natural and curly. It's just easier to use the Eco Styler in sections to get a more smooth, sleek hold. All right, now that I'm on the outside or perimeter of her hair, I'm gonna add more Eco Styler and continue to brush it through. And then here is where I'm gonna add the other products. On top of that, I'll go in with the Got To Be Glued Gel, and this just helps to make the hair hard and stay in place. Um, and then you'll see me go over that after i secure it then i'll get my blow dryer just to dry up some of that product and help lay down any flyaways and i have the blow dryer on medium heat because i don't want to burn the poach out head up so use it on medium heat and just use your comb to just lay down the stray hairs that may still be sticking out now that her entire head is molded down, I'm going to secure her head with a scarf just to make sure that her hair lays down. This is a great tip for anybody that is natural. If you want your hair to lay down after you, after you mold it down, tie it up with the scarf. So now what I'm going to do with her ponytail is I'm going to split it in sections and make little plaits just so that she doesn't have a really huge ball in the center of her ponytail and it's easier to hide. So I'm going to do that and I'll be right back. All right, so now that her ponytail is all braided, I'm just going to oil her ends just to make sure that she has some moisture, you know, underneath that ponytail and then I'm going to secure uh, all the braids into a neat little ball with a rubber band Really quickly. I just want to let you know that the hair that I'm using is my Indian curly hair from my hair company sister lens You can shop www.sisterlens.com This is the Indian curly and I believe an eight inch and I'm just going to start by wrapping the actual hair Around the base of her ponytail and then I'll begin to wrap the tracks and I do it this way So that way I won't have to use bobby pins because we all know how annoying those can be if they start stabbing you in your scalp And when you're wrapping the hair, you want to make sure that you keep the tracks flat against the base of the head so that way it's not lumpy or the hair is not twisting and turning and the ponytail will lay more flat and more smooth. And here is a close up of what I was talking about. So it might look like I'm being kind of rough, but I'm actually not. But I am 
pulling just so it has a little tension on the hair you do not want this ponytail to unravel you know kids like to play and roll around on the floor so you absolutely want to make sure that it's snug and now that I'm at the end of the tracks, I'm going to do the same thing I did in the beginning and take the actual hair and wrap around the base of her ponytail. And again, this is just to make sure that it stays in place and that I don't have to use bobby pins. Um, and she actually wore this hair for about a week and it did not unravel. It did not come loose, anything like that. So it definitely stays secure if you just take your time, wrap it neatly. And I am going to double secure it with a, a scrunchie. And just to style up the ponytail, I just have a bottle with water and some conditioner in it. And I'm just going to spray the hair and I'm going to use a wide tube comb to detangle and to define the curls and also you can use a paddle brush y'all this hair is so pretty it's so soft the curl lasts it doesn't tangle it doesn't shed um you can go to www.sisterlens.com and shop this hair y'all go get you some So after I'm done fluffing, I'm just going to remove her scarf. Um, you can add bows if you like or different cute little bobby pins or whatever just to make this style more girly. And yeah, that's it for this video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Give me a big thumbs up and I'll see you guys next time on Something About Drea.